And we... <laughs> Thanks, Frank. Drop oh, it yeah. on the time. God nice. damn it. <laughs> Uh, yeah, so that means that it is our 22 of 24 terrible hours. We are nearing the end, people. We are nearing the oh, end. Thank God. This is so exciting. <laughs> uh, Ethereal Blood just gave a $100 donation. Uh, so thank you very, very much for that. Um, our donation total now is at $3,621.90. Uh, everything's going great. Uh, a couple things to announce here. We are moving on to a document called Project Paranormal, uh, which was given to us by Spooks. Um, and uh, that sounds like collusion. I don't know. <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, and uh, your readers for this time are uh, myself. We've got Boots Rain Gear. Boots Rain Gear is alive. Hey, everybody. I'm alive and I'm very awake. <laughs> hey. no, 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 no. Great. Uh, we've got Jack Chick. Hey. We've got Kumquats Up. I like football. <laughs> <laughs> I have it on good authority that Kumquats Up likes football. J.W. Friedman is here. What up, what up, what up? <laughs> uh, Portax is back now. Maybe. Or not. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, and, uh, I think, uh, this is your first hour, uh, Ironicus is now in the stream. Yeah, I guess you wanted to get some real star power up in there. This is his first ever appearance on the F+, actually. First ever appearance on the F+. Uh, we talked about it a couple times. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm so glad you're here. Uh, and our artist for this hour is Positronic. Uh, yes, you are supposed to be here. We're excited to have you here. I mean... <laughs> I mean, you know, I think asking the question, I think I'm supposed to be here um, in the F plus is, is a confusing. It's what a have I done? Yeah. yeah. We need more than an hour to discuss that one. Yeah. <laughs> they saw him walking down the street and they just grabbed him by the shirt collar. Just drug him in here. So. <laughs> Uh, yeah, so uh, we are going to Project Colon Paranormal. Um, the site I would explain as, um, what do you want to say, uh, visually, visually reminiscent of Above Top Secrets. Um, <laughs> it's, uh, it's a place uh, for real, actual, honest-to-God paranormal experiences. Um, and uh, I think let's get, let's get started here. So uh, this thread is called, uh, why, I can, why Can I See Ghost? Mm. Hmm. And, <laughs> hmm. Usually they're clear, so this will be interesting. Good point. All right, uh, Jack Chick, start us off here, please. All righty. When I lived at home, I saw two ladies sitting in our living room on the couch. I turned away and looked back, and they were gone. Weird things always happened to me, and nobody else, my parents, thought I was weird. When I was alone, things would happen. I heard a woman coughing. The toilet lid would fall for no reason. That would be no is in knowledge. My pictures would fall on the floor. A pole lamp that was in the ceiling fell on my head. The radio would change stations on their own. The dial would move from the front to the back, and it went back and forth. Oh, okay. This isn't, I mean, you're not, you haven't seen a ghost yet, but that's fine. That's fine. Till this day, I still sense something. I was told my two, I was told two sister lived there. They are dead now, but I don't know if they died in the house. I had ghost follow me in school to two little kids. Why does this happen to me? See ghost a lot. <laughs> I told I my mom she lot. should have a... Yeah, my rap name is Sea Ghost a lot. <laughs> <laughs> I told my mom she should have a Ev done, but she laughed at me. This uh, this art on the stream is terrifying, by the way. I really <laughs> is. Like, it really uh, is. Horrifying. Uh, <laughs> little late in the stream to be bringing those kind of nightmares. Uh, <laughs> I, see, I see ghosts a lot. <laughs> on the Twitch feed. And then, uh, Portex, your name is uh, Grim Reaper, underscore Grim Reaper. Nobody's laughing here. Sorry, nobody's laughing. <laughs> you 
are certainly experiencing poltergeist activity. Advise the ghost that you, the owners, renters, intend to take good care of the property. <laughs> I'm actually I'm... stopping on periods, by the way. Yeah, or, no, or except for the random just... uh, apostrophes. <laughs> They're just right. floating ghostly. It's my... not ghost. It's my the ghost of are... HGTV. They're concerned <laughs> you won't have good equity value. <laughs> I've got the riding lawnmower and I've hired men to build topiary. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the ghost of Bob Vila and on my old house. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, the ghost is actually fixing the house. That'd be great. <laughs> Assure them of this. And things should quite down. I suspect you're sensitive due to your then apostrophe <laughs> age. I don't um, know if age has anything to do with it. This all started when I was 12 and hasn't stoked. I'm now 37. Do you think they want something from me? The ghost in my parents' house don't seem nice. I did see a ghost in my house a while back. I told it to leave me alone. I haven't seen it in a while, but I still sense it. I will to you advice and see what happens. And, uh, Jashik, by the way, did you, did you mention your guy's name? My name is Love to Talk to the... Love to Talk the Other Side. <laughs> That's a that's a that's a good cam girl account. <laughs> uh, before we get uh, any further, uh, the 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 very next thing that we have up here is uh, a uh, pick from John Toast, uh, which is uh, anime fanon. Uh, anime fan is coming up next, and then in our final hour. Now this is very Ooh. important. In our final hour is our last is our last battle. So. In our last battle, here are your two options. We can either read a um, a uh, cultivated, uh, uh, you know, meticulously put together, um, carefully thought out <laughs> document on WikiHow, or we can just all go to WikiHow and see what we find. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, so, uh, as we've done a couple times now in the past, uh, the battles are, uh, uh, based on your donations, and so, uh, if you want the, uh, cultivated document of WikiHow, uh, you should donate with the comment. It's a social, it's a, it's a, a document, uh, focused specifically on, uh, social-related, uh, WikiHow articles. Social-related, Ricky. So if you want that, uh, donate with the word social in your comments. Uh, and if you want us to just go to WikiHow and just see what happens. Hit the random button. That one's <laughs> just called hitting the ran random. Random. So, uh, random. So if you include uh, one of those words spelled correctly, uh, it will uh, <laughs> register your donation uh, total towards uh, whichever one you vote for. All right, what, what, so... what, 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 random battle. <laughs> I would recommend uh, also for random. They just put in their favorite random comment. Okay, you know, about so cheese and things and random. stuff. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, so, uh, so that's so that's happening. And uh, please, let's get these donation counts up. Let's uh, let's see what we close on with our wiki how. But um, okay, so um, this thread is called "Rocking Throwing Poltergeist." <laughs> <laughs> he is a throwing poltergeist who is rocking. Yeah, it's the Zach Wild poltergeist. <laughs> yeah, I want to see this concert. Uh, <laughs> my name is underscore Grim Reaper, and did I ever tell the story apostrophe about the rock slinging poltergeist? <laughs> Is this um, one of those sequel songs to Monster Mash? <laughs> <laughs> I was throwing some rocks at passing cars. Because I'm oh, a ghost, right. but I'm also it's... an asshole. <laughs> Uh, and then, uh, Ironicus, if you will... Oh, uh, no, sorry, sorry. Um, so, I just want to share. Uh, during, during the years, comma, 1962... 1963 and 1964, a rock throwing poltergeist paid us a visit. Summer through winter, no stopping it. Sometimes during the day, the rocks fell like a gentle rain on the aluminum awnings. If That's you what it to... sounds like when rocks fall on aluminum. <laughs> it's 
spooky. <laughs> if you were to go outside, a larger rock would be thrown. The police were summoned to no avail and stoned for their trouble. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Mm, harlots <laughs> you, no ghosts here you want to join i don't know um it was believed to be a prankster's dog that were brought in to no avail <laughs> you, <laughs> those prankster uh, that, dogs that was a sentence they were stoned that's, too that's a dog that wears a jughead hat <laughs> <laughs> Uh, yeah, they were stoned, too. A tall, dark figure could be seen from time to time on the property apostrophe. Always apostrophe S, lurking at night. Such a figure. Hey. 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 So Rand um, already has $111. Wow. <laughs> wow. Yeah. Oh, that's exciting. Um... Uh, such a figure was known as, quote, Tractor Man, who was killed <laughs> in a tractor. <laughs> yeah. well, whatever a tractor John can. Deere. No Vote person. up Tractor Man now on Steam Greenlight. I don't, I don't understand. I, I, I mean, I think it's just a great name for the rock throwing poltergeist to be Tractor Man. It just really makes sense. <laughs> uh, who was killed in a tractor accident in the 1930s which was several miles from us. My brother and I had encountered Tractor Man traveling in the pasture fields, apostrophe S, yes, at sundown, heading in the direction he lived. It defies what would be considered normal behavior of a ghost. The coat was black, reaching all the way to these ankles. The collar was all the way up the back of his neck, maybe seven foot tall, and glided rather than walk. That's a lot of collar. Wow. <laughs> yeah. wow. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right. So uh, much collar. <laughs> I guess this guy just didn't know what a hailstorm was. <laughs> just assumed it must have been ghosts. Ice is falling from the sky. Is it ghosts? <laughs> no, frozen rocks. Uh, That's the Next thread here is called Sign of Something Bad or Evil in the House. And uh, Ironicus, I think that's yours. Sure. Your name uh, is Double X slash Double X. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so like my mom has this Santa Claus nest thing, you know? <laughs> No. Where the Santa Claus brings yes. nope. food to I know. the baby Santa Claus. Is you mean the, the, the thing that <laughs> controls your temperature in your apartment? Whose mom yeah. doesn't live inside of Santa Claus? Big ups to whoever donated that lives in inside a Santa Claus nest with their mom. <laughs> <laughs> you know, we're like, there's, there's, there's thing, big thing. <laughs> yeah. You know, you know, you know, you know. It's Why Chronicles you? of Narnia, but darker. <laughs> There's thing, big thing on the outside. Then when you open it up, the thing gets smaller, and you keep <laughs> doing it, and it keeps getting smaller and oh, smaller. Oh, oh, okay. No, Santa That's Claus nice. nest thing, right? Yeah, <laughs> right. Mm -hmm. Well, see, not on the outside one, but on all the inside ones, all had in black ink and. We later confirmed you could indeed write on it with a pen. The number 666, and on the yeah. last one, it had 917, which is my stepbrother's <laughs> birthday, September 17th. So my mom was asking what she found out who did it. And I don't know. She even had something like that. So we figured it was just my stepbrother who did it probably years. You know, probably. 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 But then a few days later, after she discovered, she went to open it again, and the number 666 was obviously still on all of them, except this time, the ink had turned red for all of them, except 917! It still <laughs> stayed in black ink. This didn't happen. Wait, why do you think that? Why do you think this didn't happen? Because it just didn't, that's why. <laughs> Wait, do you think the ghosts are enumerate? I'll I tell just... you why it didn't happen. Because my mom does not have a red pen in the house. Oh! Wow! Yeah. I checked everywhere. And my stepbrother... I'll tell you... Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> no, fine. A, a fellow XX slasher can go right ahead. I, I'm just saying I know exactly why it happened. Because 666, number of the beast. That's red. 917, area code of Brooklyn. <laughs> <laughs> 
it's not red and evil at all. It's just it's an area code for a, you know kind of not not a particularly bad part of Brooklyn either. So I'm just yeah. saying, right. it doesn't deserve the scary treatment. <laughs> My stepbrother, nor me, haven't been in her house for, like, about two weeks before she even discovered the black ink on it. Then as soon as she did, it turned red on all of the 666s, except for 917! <laughs> so I'm wondering, is this a sign of an evil spirit in my house? Presumably, yeah. And also, the Santa Claus... <laughs> Motherfucker. And also... <laughs> The Santa Claus nest thing was one of my deceased grandmother's possessions. Your grandma was a demon. Also, I really want to point out the art that's going on right now. The Santa Claus nest. <laughs> I love Santa Claus nest thing. Yeah, it's actual like holiday decoration. <laughs> People wonder what the fuck is going on. It's good stuff. Uh, so Jay, uh, you got a problem, and I'm pretty sure Project Paranormal can help you. Um, oh gosh, is, is, does my problem involve some, some love with a ghost? No, 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 you just, uh, you can't find your wallet. Oh, oh, okay, I'm he sorry. He really wanted to fuck that ghost. <laughs> he didn't want to fuck the ghost, I was just looking at the wrong place. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, th this is a big problem, too, in addition to wanting to fuck ghosts, and I'm, s <laughs> I'm super hoping someone can help me out. So, like, uh... <sighs> can anyone please offer me some advice about where my missing wallet could be? I lost it about three days ago. It's black leather, and has many coins in it, making it large and heavy. I, I don't think there's any cash in it. Any ideas would be much appreciated. I have searched my house and car many times to no avail. The what are, what are the, the, coin, the coins? coins are our, the, the coins are arcade tokens, so. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, everybody knows that ghosts are trying to collect all 50 state quarters. <laughs> <laughs> They're just quite large and heavy, and I know when they're in my car, it responds differently to acceleration, deceleration, breaking points, turning radius. When my arcane <laughs> coins, which are right, large uh, and heavy, Portex. are occupying the passenger seat. Portex, uh, you have a response to that. You can help. Oh, yeah, I'm Mazeppa Papazoidi. <laughs> cool. I got the vibe that it is enclosed in something like a bag or an attaché case. Whatever kind of bag it is. Black. Much like you want it. Mm. Good luck with this. Bad. Wow. wow. Do you think that Mazappa just like goes around this forum and just tells everyone where their wallet is? <laughs> Probably. <laughs> uh, Alright. Uh, Frank West? Yes. We, we, we're just solving problems for everyone here in the Project Paranormal forums. What do you got? Paranormal job opportunities? I was just wondering if anyone knew any jobs that relate to the paranormal. Because I would love to be in an investigation team, but I've heard that they don't actually get... <laughs> How much to have us actually invite Hanson to read with us? As, 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 uh, as just a uh, as just a note here, um, uh, <laughs> the the most recent donation is from somebody who's named Boots Rain Gear, <laughs> <laughs> who who gave fifty dollars and said, "Fuck this stupid podcast." We finally did it. <laughs> We're gonna fuck this podcast. <laughs> it's gonna be awesome. Fuck this podcast! Fuck this podcast! real good. Just slide it in there, yeah. There you go. <laughs> Fuck the podcast. <laughs> uh, all right. So, uh, um, uh, yeah. Yeah. Oh shit! We got to four thousand. Yeah, we got to four thousand. That was 4, on the button exactly. You know what that means? Uh, I'm gonna just go lyrics. Ooh, Bob Hansen. <laughs> You're gonna get. Oh god, gonna we gotta lyrics, do that. Huh? Again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Are we doing uh, uh, the actual song or like a ghost version? Yes, no, you may need to make it very spooky. Very spooky. Spook, all right, all right, all right. 
So, uh, so here is I'm gonna just paste in the order that we're gonna do here. I'm <laughs> drawing <laughs> fuck this face on the stream, but. <laughs> uh, so, so in the order uh, specified there, um, we're just gonna go through every time you see like a double line break, uh, you tag out. Uh, so Jay, start us off. Okay, hang on one second here. <laughs> Open. All right. So. Uh, Oh, whoa, 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 <laughs> yeah! Frank West? Oh, sorry, I'm second, my bad. Yep, yep. You have so many relationships in this <laughs> life. Oh, God. Ah, only ah. one or two will last. <laughs> you go through all the pain and the strife. Then you turn their back and they're gone so fast. <laughs> Oh, yeah. I really committed to this one, huh? And they're gone so fast, yeah. Ooh. Oh. <laughs> so hold on to the ones who really care. In the end, they'll be the only ones there. And when you get old and start losing your hair, can you tell me who will still care? Can you tell me who will still care? Who care? Pop, pop, do ba do pop, boo ba top, ba do pop, ba do pop, ba do pop, ba do yeah, pop, ba do ba pop, ba do pop, ba do ba boo pop, ba do ba boo do yeah. Just getting closer and closer to someone <laughs> whispering that in the room. I'm are sitting we... in your lap now, Portex. Are we getting uh, drawings of Ghost Hansen? We I think we guess. are. <laughs> I said, oh yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Bob, they're gone! Yeah! That yeah! Is... <laughs> that, was, that is terrifying. If you thought the house was empty and you started to hear that, that would scare you. <laughs> Hello, I'm a ghost. Hello! <laughs> I just ran and I grabbed my guitar and I was all ready to start playing umbop chords along with the chorus, but it's really <laughs> hard to find chords online anymore. Everyone mm -hmm. just wants to redirect you to sell you something. Yeah. What happened to the glory days of finding Hanson songs online <laughs> <laughs> without yes, the interruptions of corporate America and late capitalism fucking with their fucking Hanson groove? I liked Hanson before they sold out myself as well. Yeah, I mean, Hanson's got beer now. <laughs> what? Fucking posers. Is Portex going? Uh, Portex. Yeah, Portex. Portex going to breed? Or... <laughs> oh, okay. Is that... Okay, it's the last part. You're planting a seed. I'm planting a planting seed. seed. Planting a seed. Oh, shit. Hang on. God there damn it. Okay. Plant a seed. Sorry. Okay, plant, plant a seed. Yeah. Planting a seed. Plant a flower. Plant a rose. You can't plant any of those. You can. <laughs> but you can't because they're dead. Keep planting to find out which one grows. It's a secret no one knows. It's a secret no one knows. No one knows. No one knows. No one knows. Bop. Badoo ba dop. Badoo dop. Badoo ba dop. Badoo bop. Badoo ba dop. Badoo yeah. Mbop, badoo badop, badoo dop, badoo dop, badoo bop, badoo dop, badoo ya. In an umbop they're gone, in an umbop they're not there. Oh no, the whistle is malfunctioning. They're gone. In an umbop they're not there until you lose your hair. Oh, but you don't care. Oh yeah. Mbop, badoo ba dop, badoo bop. Badu ba da, badu ba, badu ba da, badu. Yeah. Mmm ba, badu ba, badu ba, badu ba, badu ba, badu ba, badu. Yeah. All right, I think Jay's on uh, guitar duty, so we're gonna go skip to Frank West. Okay. Right. Let's talk. Am I back on? Can you tell work. me? <laughs> you could look playing along with this. Just random. Can you tell me? Oh, no, you can't because you don't know. 
Can you tell me? Oh, yeah. You say you can, but you don't know. Can you tell me? Oh? Which flower's gonna grow? No, you can't, because you don't know. Can you tell me? If it's gonna be a daisy or a rose? You say you can, but you don't know. Can you tell me? Oh. Which flower's gonna grow? <laughs> you know you can't, because you don't know. Can you tell me? You say you can, but you don't know. You say you can, but you don't know. You don't know. You don't know. Oh. <laughs> can I point out that we just got a donation from Shaggy Two Ghosts? <laughs> Whoop whoop M M F C L motherfucker Fuck twisted <laughs> Oh god okay yeah <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck Uh yeah no actually if we're gonna be spooky then I have to be spooky like psychopathic records <laughs> Yeah Ooh, Bop Dooba Do Bop Do Yeah Yeah mm, Bop Dooba Do Bop Do Oh yeah can that be someone someone ring tone that uh, and then Ironicus finish it off. Oh, <laughs> this is important work we're doing. Yeah, that's it true. It's true. Can you tell me? Oh, no, you can't, because you don't know. Can you tell me? You say you can, but you don't know. Say you can, but you don't know. Written by Isaac Hansen, <laughs> <laughs> Zachary Walker Hansen, copyright C icon, one of Dash Chappelle Music Incorporated. All right, all right, all right. All right. <laughs> thank you, thank you. You paid for that. Uh, okay, so. <laughs> Uh, like how we offer uh, like both donation incentives and donation disincentives. <laughs> <laughs> Donate to get them stop sucking hands. <laughs> well, intermittent reinforcement is the hardest kind of reinforcement. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, okay, yeah, so and, and just let me know if you want me to look up any more changes and awkwardly play guitar with <laughs> <laughs> bad song parodies. I'm uh, I'm your host. Uncle Barry. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so uh, Boots, uh, your name is Kel Kel, and uh, what's your question there? Uh, where are the bones? <laughs> <laughs> have you ever wondered why they never have found any Bigfoot bones? Not really. <laughs> I have one theory. It seems by but now we should have, but there are none. I believe the hand bones in Nepal were proven to be human, not that of the Yeti. Do you think finding Bigfoot bones is so difficult? Are they not looking in the right place? Does Bigfoot do something with the bones that they're dead to hide them? Cal. Or Kelly. I don't know. The dude does something with the bones of the dead. Like, mm -hmm. like what? What would, you, what would you expect? Eat them. Oh, okay. Yeah. Grind them up. Make them into a... <laughs> Bury them so deep, they'll never be recovered, brother. <laughs> You said you wouldn't do that again. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. You're a liar. Uh, Frank West. Bigfoot this might be a stretch, but maybe the Bigfoot phenomena are really cavemen ghosts. <laughs> that might then, be a possibly. Stretch. Oh, that's that symbol for an emoticon. Ugh. <laughs> that would explain the fact that no bones were found. You should probably you would probably have to dig pretty deep depending on the area. Hmm? Uh, and then Ironicus, you are Sherman. As I said in another place, I can't remember where. <laughs> so as you so Sherman. <laughs> well, as you get older, reality begins to blend. I believe these creatures come and go through a portal, many of which are scattered throughout the world. Maybe even your website is one. What, like a web portal? <laughs> <laughs> Sasquatches are coming through web portals. <laughs> Back in my day, people put their portals in a great ring. <laughs> 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 
They have no intentions of dying in your reality, hence, uh, no bones. Maybe you're just a weekend retreat, kind of a place to take a weekend from the Hosal and Busal of everyday life. <laughs> <laughs> That's not how you spell either, though. <laughs> a little sideshow that reminds them just how lucky they are not to live in such a crazy warlike corner of the universe. Thank God we got off that little sroth of a planet alive. Man, were they weird or what? Many different life forms may come through these portals. Investigate. Hmm, very interesting. Yeah, interesting. And leave. Some may come again and again, while others say, Once was enough. Thank you. What awful people. Some <laughs> may. Tourist? <laughs> <laughs> they have cameras and stuff. Bigfoot aren't just tourists, they're snooty tourists. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody speaks Bigfoot language here. Mm, what peasants? Mm, mm. Some may even be up to no good, but then there are a hell of a lot of us that are up to no real good either. At least I hope some of them have had a good time while they're here. And maybe we should leave a signpost up near one of these suspected portals saying something like, Hope you've enjoyed your stay. Please come again. Next time, bring a friend or two or more. Ooh, the government. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, no, I think it's a good idea to just start putting signs up everywhere saying, Welcome Bigfoot. <laughs> Maybe you want to get a little frisky, Bigfoot. Say it loud, say it clear, Bigfoots are welcome here. <laughs> uh, the government, I'm sure, knows where some of them are, and if I know our government, there's probably a big, big sign. <laughs> Yeah, mm -hmm. right. yeah, a right. big, mm -hmm. big sign somewhere in some deep, dank woods that says aliens and space-like people check all weapons and bones at the nearest security station before <laughs> entering. <laughs> <laughs> check your bones. Uh, yeah. I'm, sir, do you have any skeletons to declare? Uh, <laughs> I hope that helped you. What? Well, you can't please everybody now, can you? Wow. <laughs> Have fun. We'll travel. Sherman. Thanks, Sherman. <laughs> uh, I'd just like to point out that in the in the chat, Muffinator uh, has provided us with the, ch the title of the new Chuck Tingle novel, uh, <laughs> Pounded in the Butt by the Ridiculous Reading About Bigfoot's Ghost. All right. <laughs> Anyone have Chuck Tingle's email? We need to make that happen. <laughs> How would you like tens of dollars, Chuck Tingle? <laughs> uh, moving on to a different topic now. Uh, Jack Chick, uh, this topic is called My Boy. Yeah, so I'm a Lizzie girl. Hi, all. It's been a long time since I've been able to take time and visit. Wanted to share something interesting that's been going on with my youngest boy. My youngest is seven years old, and for the last year or so, he's been doing some major contemplation on life. Every he so often. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I did say he was my son. <laughs> Every so often, I will find him sitting in deep thought, and when asked, he'll say, I just can't figure it out. Why did God send me to you? Okay, wait. Oh. I, got a, I got a question. I got a question. Does, <laughs> does your son drop a lot of LSD? <laughs> my, my question is the tone of voice your son used saying that. <laughs> yeah, it kind of sounds like he's just an asshole. <laughs> or... I'm just wondering what's waiting for me out there. What's ahead of me in life? He's also been asking, since he could talk practically, for a baby sister and telling me that something's missing right there, pointing to his heart. So what do you all think? Any suggestions on how to address this the next time it comes up? Take away the never-ending story. DVD. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Uh, all right. All right. Jay, here's your concession. This is the last thing you can read as Macho Man Randy Savage. <laughs> God damn it. You pinky swear with me right now. And your name is Ghost Watch. My name is Ghost Watch. And, yep. Okay. Yep. And yeah, I do. I swear. This is the last uh, Macho Man. I'll do. 
This little one is much wiser than his age. To ask such intellectual questions as those are just amazing. At one time or another, we all start asking why, when, where, but that usually comes with age and much is learning. Your son is truly an advanced soul. Dig it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so... We should tell people to donate for more Macho Man. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, this is a uh, Kumquat Stop request. Um, uh, it's, a, it's, a, it's called Ghosts and Technology. Uh, we don't really need to um, talk about the OP. It's, it's about ghosts and technology. And it's, it's about, you know, the thing where ghosts turn televisions on and off like they do. Uh, mm -hmm. and, it, and it ends love and light, moonlight. Uh, but yeah, what's your response there, uh, Kumquat? My, my name's AZ Spirit. Uh, this subject is very interesting. <laughs> I, th Hi. There have been times when I believe that there is more power in the spiritual realm than people even notice or give credit for. Many people will say, I don't believe in ghosts or spirits. Oh, and then fool. close their fool. mind to any oh. further input. Disgusting. Sure. <laughs> It is their right to believe what they wish, but there are so many unexplained things that point to a spirit or ghost manipulating things in ways that are beyond our comprehension. One example that just happens to fit into the holiday season is our experiences with strange occurrences with lights. Not ordinary lights, but especially Christmas tree lights that are the chasing lights that have several patterns to choose from in a random setting that makes them select certain patterns of chasing at very Wait, intervals on their own. Do you mean stranger things? Is that what you're talking about right now? No, 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 <laughs> okay. no I don't. No. Spirits. Okay. This is what I, they are meant to do, right? Right? Uh, yeah, well, okay, right. now. Uh, uh, yes, do just don't add, shoot me. <laughs> what we do is add music like Christmas music. <laughs> ah! Ah! <laughs> Both vocal and instrumental. We play the music and watch the lights, and they will do things that we never thought were possible. Oh, like your taxes or something? Or something? You, just, you just keep your eye on the lights, brother, and all God damn it! And all the <laughs> I'm still getting Macho Man of the Art, too, on the screen, so that's good. <laughs> Always sneak it up behind you while you're looking at the light. All right, I'll stop. <laughs> I don't believe I've, you. I heard that before. <laughs> I okay, woke okay, up at okay. 10 in the morning to do this and then drank tequila. So this is your I, I can't tell. That's such a surprise to hear. <laughs> oh, no. Maybe it's the ghost of Macho Man. Maybe we're channeling him. Oh. Okay, 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 okay. Yeah. What we do okay. is... Uh, uh, we already have music. The lights follow the music. Uh, reacting to music tempo, uh, feeling loudness, softness, and it is giving us all goosebumps just experiencing it. And, and, I, and I bought this <laughs> this toy plant at the mall, and I set it next to the radio, and it started dancing. Uh, it's a ghost. a ghost! It's a ghost plant! Oh, I God. mounted a fish on my wall, and it spawned <laughs> to me! <laughs> The, the ghost tribe of Billy. <laughs> <laughs> Others that we show it can also recognize it and are just amazed that two... Oh my god, guys, get this! Guys, guys! Uh, 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 uh. Two electrical devices can do different things! What? Oh my god. Um, what? Yes, yes. Two different electrical devices can do different things. Technology is the new magic. And yet, we mm -hmm. so in sync with each other. This is both a very intense and thought provoking occurrence. Oh my god. With the help I'm... of the ghosts, I've become the most annoying person in the neighborhood. <laughs> Another thing I've discovered that is similar to the Bava Karantz, but has to do with the screensaver on our two Macintoshes! Well, <laughs> those toasters have wings! They can't fly! <laughs> More like ghosters! <laughs> <laughs> 
This screensaver is called Flurry, and it is a point of light that moves randomly around on the screen with numerous flares or tails emanating from it. It uses all the colors of the rainbow and yep. does a northern lights looking curtain style sweeping motion with various colors. And it also shoots off separate pieces that look like fireworks or cutouts. Totally random without ready recognizable pattern or predictable moves. You can obtain a downloadable version of this for any Windows PC. Large screen server for Windows PC. You are all back to I believe it came with the OSX software. Here's where it gets interesting. Go and I have two back G4 side by side. We use the flurry screen. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. We, need, we need to tune Kumquaties. So. <laughs> <laughs> just, just, just fuck with the Nile. Like a quarter, a I think a quarter turn somewhere. counterclockwise will get it back. <laughs> Hold some Christmas lights up next to him. He'll come back and sink. No one can understand a fucking thing you're saying. Come quiet. All right. All right. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. All right. Uh, so, uh, come quads up. Uh, scroll down here uh, to. I have no way to explain what happens. I have no way to explain what happens between the lights, computers, and the music here in our house. But the whole thing seems to be coming from the spirit realm, in our estimation. How else could this happen by chance? By chance? You just said so! <laughs> <laughs> How else could this happen, parentheses, by chance, parentheses? Mm -hmm. If you can get your hands on this screensaver, try it with any music you like. It's not random. We have seen the screensaver. And the tree lights react to various musical genres, but we have never seen the screensavers in sync before. <laughs> Here we are with an unexplainable. Did you hear me? Unexplainable. 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 Happening involving electrical devices, and it seems that the control is coming from a source. Other than the device themselves. Any ideas, anyone? <laughs> yeah, many, I, many. By chance? All I know is my Christmas lights are really into trip hop, okay? I can't explain <laughs> it. <laughs> <laughs> Them is some chill Christmas lights. All I right. I, I can't wait for the uh, paranormal forum to discover the Internet of Things. <laughs> <laughs> that's a ghost, and that's a ghost, and that's a ghost. Uh, there's a whole bunch of great things in this document, uh, but there's a bunch of them that are pretty long. Um, targeted by the reptilians is great. Uh, was the stupid also great? Uh, but I think we're going to close off here on strange voices. Uh, so, Jack Chick, uh, start us off here, and well, your I, name... I was invited as a guest, and now you're insulting me? Goodness <laughs> gracious. <laughs> <laughs> um, uh, so, Jack Chick, start us off here with uh, Strange Voices. Uh, you're Grim Reaper? Yeah, I am. I'm underscore Grim Reaper. Trust me, I respect those who frequent this site. Here's one <laughs> for the books. Some yeah. time back, I was working alone. I felt as though there was something I had to accomplish. So out of the clear blue, I said, God, what is it you want me to do? I was instantly froze to the ground. A voice came to the right side of my ear and said, it's the devil. A voice much stronger came to the left here and said, in Old English, ye shall be baptized <laughs> and, become, <laughs> and become a healer of men. Tell them you are not he. All advice welcome. This is driving me crazy looking for answers. Uh, and then uh, take that first response too, please. Hi, uh, hey, it's Grim Reaper again. Hey, this is a legit question. No <laughs> schizophrenia or delusions of grandeur here. This is as paranormal as you can get. Got some very well-spoken people here. Let's get some comment parentheses. 
Yeah, and and you do, and you do get uh, a number of comments. Uh, one of them oh. is is by uh, as as spirit as the as spirit. It's the as spirit. And, as uh, spirit. <laughs> yeah, take it. What a frightening thing to have intertwined into your life over such a long period. Have you ever had your house blessed to help rid you of this horrible monster? It can be blessed by a Catholic priest or a shaman from a nearby Native American tribe. Same thing. Or, or you can do a house blessing on your own. If you know some Native American tribes in your area, contact them and ask if they have a shaman who will do a house blessing for you. Don't do that! For the love of God, if you have Native Americans in your neighborhood, don't be like, uh, yeah, I know you're like magical wood elves and shit. Could you like cast a spell of demon exorcism for me? Uh, you can get your feathers and your little magic crystals and shit. Just... Fucking do not do that. They will fucking snap your neck in half. All right, like, so, Max, I don't think you stop. understand the problem that I'm having here. <laughs> well, while, while you're doing right. it, see if you, so, they can get you some cheap smokes too. <laughs> so, so you've got your you've got your druid from the local Native American tribe. You, you've got a priest from the Catholic Church. Just go spring a thief from prison, and you're on your way to a great adventuring party. <laughs> <laughs> You have been through such an ordeal. I can understand why you are careful about who you talk to about this. Many people do not understand and are certain that it is a problem with your own mental health that is creating the troubles. That isn't necessarily the case at all, but many are afraid to even consider facing something like this and admitting to themselves that it is real. It is real. It is real. Uh, and then uh, Jack Chick, uh, Grim Reaper, uh, your response to that. Five priests later, and I'm still counting. This thing does not follow the norm. It's cunning. It said demons don't follow you home, etc. That's trash. Five <laughs> priests later, and still counting. Aside from the fact that they think I am crazy, I can't make it appear, and it refuses to stay, allowing to demand its name. <laughs> so you're being haunted by Michigan J Frog? <laughs> <laughs> uh yeah and that was uh our 22 of 24 terrible hours we're so close to the end we're so close to the end uh, i mean could they sucks. donate for every time would you guys be no 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 that is not on the table absolutely not <laughs> i'm on my last wind here if, it, if that comes up it's all deflated i just fall over yeah Absolutely, absolutely. You're just checking uh, your bones, it's fine. Uh, we are going to be uh, coming back after the break with Anime Fanon, uh, a document Maybe. given given to us by A Meat, and it looks like in that one we're going to have uh, Boots Rain Gear, Lemon, Jack Chick, Jimmy Franks, John Toast, Portax, and let's get one more from Ironicus. Hey, all right. Yeah. I all love right. the anime. <laughs> <laughs> be back soon so stick around if you got weed now it's safe to smoke it it's fine bye yeah.